Well, a number of local streets are closed due to flooding caused by the rain Debbie dumped on our area last week. News 13's Carly Knowlton is at Riverfront Park in Conway to tell us what she's seen today. The bottom of Elm and Laurel Sheet are both blocked off due to the excess water coming in from the Waccamaw River. I spoke with a Conway Riverwalk employee who said that the park and Riverwalk entrances are closed indefinitely until the floodwaters go down. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration says the Waccamaw River has entered major flood stage and is expected to crest around 15 feet on Monday before it slowly starts falling. One person who lives in Conway told me this location is always getting flooded. He explained how the area looked eight years ago after Hurricane Matthew compared to today. This whole uh, area was underwater with like where we're standing right now. And I was telling the uh, lady right here, the condos over here, it was up to the first floor. This is bad, but this is nothing compared to what I've seen. Prina thinks it will at least be another two weeks before the water recedes and he can go back to his daily walks in the park. Reporting in Conway, Carly Knowlton, News 13.